Welcome back to The Sims 4 Dream Home Decorator. Today we got the bills to pay, we're going to do some big gigs, and we're going to earn a lot of money. Now something that I always seem to forget is that uh, there's actually the reward trait for helping with bills. The frugal reward trait, which you guys rem reminded me of, uh, so this will reduce my bills. It doesn't actually say by how much, but I'm going to have it a guess that it's probably going to help. So I want to actually do some of our aspiration today because we've kind of just had this here the whole time and not really done much. We need to sell three paintings to collectors or art galleries now. I know we had a rule that we weren't selling, you know, stuff to the, to the void, like just selling stuff here. But to complete the aspiration, we kind of have to do that. So I think that'll probably be a good idea to start getting onto that. Now, you're doing a poop on the little balcony. That's good. I'll go, uh, 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 hug. Sure, good boy. <laughs> and then we can brush. And then I might clean up, uh, this afterwards. Probably a good idea. Actually, wait, does the robot do that? Hang on. Wait, wait, if I don't do, does, will my robot do that? I guess so. I don't see why not. It's technically trash. Although these robots in real life going over, uh, pet business, really not nice. Really bad. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, it's scrubbing. Let's see. Oh, there it goes. Okay, yeah, so it actually does work. That's good. Okay, so what happened to my easel? It's downstairs, isn't it? It's down here. Uh, oh, yeah, is my power off? <laughs> yeah, my bills. Yeah, look, the bills, $3,800. Now, I always get the comment, and I swear, I'm going to have to do, like, a science video on this. Like, a Dr. Gluon Sim science video, because... People always say it's the lights, it's your auto lights. I'm telling you, it's not the lights. Look, the, the light, the power, which includes lights, is only 242. The lot taxes is where, where we're getting destroyed. And that, as you guys pointed out, is probably because we have, well, we got three computers. So there's this one, that one's actually not worth that much. I think that one's only a thousand. This one I think is a lot more. Let me have a look, if I copy that. This one is worth 4,250. This one is worth 10,000. Uh, so those are adding up massively to our lot. We have a look at the lot value. It's now 90,000 simoleons. Uh, and those are gonna be a large part of it. And probably, there's probably some, oh, no, this stuff isn't that valuable. This is kind of junk in here. A few things. Ooh, Supreme Freelancer Award. I don't mind if I do. Put that in my, in my office, there you go. What is this? A pile of dust? Cool. What did I get? Unlocked for the first time, say max out the performance meter in freelance career. Oh, as a freelance artist? Well, we're not a freelance artist, so I don't know why I have this, but I guess that's cool. Did I steal it? Maybe I stole it. I don't remember. Uh, yeah, so we just have a lot of valuable stuff. Uh, can I put it in? Oh, that's not mine. Uh, I got nowhere to put it, so whatever. <laughs> yeah, we just got a lot of valuable stuff. I think that's where the problem is. Also, um, there's a comment about the reason is these other houses. These houses are not real houses. They're worth zero simoleons. Uh, all of this is worth zero. The only thing on this whole entire portion of the lot that's worth anything is actually these rooms, because these are the only two actual things we spent money for. Oh, and I guess the fences too. The fences are money, but the rest of that is not really worth anything. So we got to pay back our bills. I think what we should do is, mate, let's just go paint, because I honestly think... Okay, I'm gonna actually take this outside. It's a bit sad down there. I honestly think if we do some, let me do a large abstract and we just sell these. Because first of all, selling them will get us money, which I know again was kind of against our rules to sell the paintings, but it's part of our aspiration, which we need to do anyway. So we might as well do a little bit of painting and sell these on. There you go, sell to collector, 235. If we do that, that's one of them. Do a large classic painting next. I should probably actually, while I'm here, check the gigs. Is there, um... oh good, there's two of my myself again. Fantastic, so let's not, Go there again, that really didn't work. <laughs> we got a few of the big wallet ones. Rick's Farm, ooh, Hobby Room Edition. Yeah, the problem with that is it only pays me 625. <laughs> I think I would rather do like the level stuff on the Rick's Farm, like if we can do a whole level again. So I'm gonna, I'm not gonna do that one. Also, cause I wanna save up money in that let's play to do the renovation. So I think we'll leave that one. We could do the bathroom renovation, the eco lifestyle one or a room renovation in the university one. See, last time we went to the university one, we weren't able to do it because it was a room addition. But this is a room renovation, so we should be fine. So I'm going to try doing that one. That one is tomorrow. Um, and then after that, we'll do like a really big one that pays like 25 grand or something. Because then we can buy the next door house and, you know, start doing that whole portion as well. So that will be something we work towards. So let's sell this. That's two of three. I need to do emotional paintings. Let me, um, let me just cloud gaze for a second because I'm going to be inspired. Okay. Why are you stopping fine? Don't be emotionally mindful. Be emotionally emotional, please. I'm being emotionally mindful by doing nothing and feeling nothing. I don't want emotional control. I want to let loose. 
<laughs> okay, well, let's just do another painting because then we can complete this. I need 2,000 points here. So will this go away or is this just, is that a life? What is that? Workaholic. Okay, can I, why can't I see the last? It's annoying. Okay, like here. Wait, what? Why are these like, I I never use this lifestyle thing even in Snowy Escape. I don't understand. Like, why are my ones grayed out? Shouldn't I be able to, s I don't understand this. Reward store? But this just goes to the regular reward store. I'm very confused by this. I don't quite understand any of this stuff and I can't even see all of them. Right. Well, I'll just ignore that. That's a pretty good painting to be honest. All right, sell that. All right, so that's 250. I need to complete three emotional paintings, but you're not emotional. Why are you not emotional? Maybe I Google this. <laughs> what are the auto completes is emotionally mindful, annoying. <laughs> that's the auto complete. I'm good. Wait, is that, what is it from? I don't even know where it's coming from. Is it? It's not one of these, is it? So the, apparently we click here on myself. Apparently there's like an emotional surge option. Hmm. I'm not really sure. I don't even know how I got it. <laughs> what if I just be gross? Maybe that'll get rid of it. Surely, how can I be mindful if I'm no. farting and burping? <laughs> okay, let's just cloud gaze again. Go, no, don't go up. Why is that going up? Go down. Uh, what if I flaunt my wealth? Money phone. That's not mindful. It's like the least mindful thing. Look, she's talking into a wad of cash. <laughs> she's flaunting her wealth whilst we owe thousands of Somalians. Go away, I don't like you. Okay, I got 50 minutes left. Gosh, all right, well, can we, what's something, there's gonna be, can I do something anti-mindful or something? Cause, <laughs> do I know these plants need caring for? I've not really been doing that. Yeah, water them all, there you go. What, no, 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 what, no, it went up. Why is it four hours? Why? Ah, uh, what, just cause I'm taking care of my garden. That should make me happy if anything. No, it goes up if I cloud gaze. I wanna be, ins oh my gosh. How to delete emotionally mindful Sims 4. Okay, if I switch to more intense activity, oh, it's just like programming. Okay, I can't program. Uh, working out, do I have anything to work out? Does jogging count or is that mindful too? Cause I just want to do, why is an emotional painting now suddenly the hardest thing to do in this game? <laughs> why won't you go away? <laughs> Let's go away. Oh, hey Hagrid. Why don't we go, let's go for a jog together. That better not be mindful, I swear. How is everything mindful? Wait, it's not going up, which is a good sign. I don't care, oh my gosh, good, let's go home. The problem is, what, so I think painting is mindful apparently, which is r ridiculous. If you're, if you're, like a whole feature of this game is to do in like emotional paintings, <laughs> like I, but I become mindful by painting. That doesn't make any sense. Okay, stop sniffing the dirt. Okay, there we go. Okay, good. Paint. We just gotta do three of these. Okay, Hagrid wants a little bit of attention, so of course we will give him attention. There you go. Uh oh, they shut off my water. Yeah, yeah, I'm working on it. Okay, wait, how much are my bills? Because I got three thousand dollars now from selling my painting. Three thousand eight hundred. Mmm. So I guess tomorrow, if I don't pay the bills, is when the Reaper Man comes, right? Okay, let's quick. I gotta do a. Uh, I thought I could do an inspired painting. Guess not. Maybe, okay, so inspired is not really what I want. Maybe, let me just try confident again. If we just go practice speech or something. Wait, no, no, sorry, brush teeth. Oh, wait, I've got no water, damn it. Okay, psych self up. <laughs> That's right, I have no water anymore. Okay, we're confident, we can do another one. Confident painting, there you go. What's wrong, Hagrid? You got food, you just want attention again, okay. Is that done? It is done. Oh no, six hours? Go away, I hate you. Ah, oh, it's the worst thing ever, all right. <laughs> yeah, that's the worst thing ever. I mean, it's so annoying. What is this? Tradition complete. Decorating. I didn't decorate. What are you talking about? Are you okay? Are you scared of the fireplace or? No, I think you're just hanging out. Wait, no, now you're scared. It's okay. Hang on. Um, I got this. I got this. We just got to calm down Hagrid and then he'll learn to not be scared of the fireplace. It's okay, Hagrid. You can just, it's fine. Yeah, there you go. All right, sleeping. I can't really have any food, can I? Because <laughs> I don't have any power or water. Is that, I can't even have a quick meal. Is that not a thing? Oh no, I can't have a quick meal. Okay, I don't know how I have cereal because we wouldn't have milk. <gasps> oh wait, 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 stop, 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 stop. Oh no, I changed my window. Ah, quick, quick. We're gonna do one more, one more of these. And then we will have completed this. Look at all these mushrooms out here, dang. Hey, there we go, milestone complete. All right, cool. So next up, we gotta do complete 10 excellent paintings. View or admire three paintings at a museum. All right, well, we'll do that later. Now, did you ever eat? I know I pulled you away from it. So maybe just go quickly do that before work. We got work soon in 30 minutes, which is, oh yeah, we're gonna go see the Big Wallet University household, which should be pretty good. Uh, thankfully, I'm emotionally mindful again. So that's just fantastic. Uh, I guess, so I've got these three paintings in here. We're definitely gonna put them up in the house. Alrighty. Oh, you guys are getting old now. Hey Grim. <laughs> I always forget he lives here. Let's get a cheerful introduction to Grim. Maybe if we get on his good side, he'll be nice to me. 
Hey, man. <laughs> oh, good to see you, Hazel. <laughs> I'll be seeing you very soon, Hazel. Uh, excuse me? Anyway, let's uh, talk about previous projects and uh, let's see Grimm's mood board. I'm actually curious what likes and dislikes does Grimm have. All right, Grimm, what, what are you thinking here? Also, you guys got a bunch of mail. I don't know if you noticed. Okay, Grimm likes cooking and violin. There you go. Isn't that nice? Enthused about the thrill of the steel. Oh, and he dislikes boho decor. Okay, where's the front door? Is it this one? Yeah, knock on door. Now, again, I think this house has the locked doors on this side, so I don't think I can actually get through over here. Like, if I say go here, no, I can't. But what I might just do, I, I, I'm happy to just teleport myself inside, to be honest. Yeah, because then I can actually get in and, and do stuff. So what am I doing here? Gig room renovation. What room am I doing? I don't know. Let's go to build mode real quick. All right, send Klein away. We're just going to work with whatever this is. <laughs> I'll head out now. See you later. This is so funny that it's grim. Okay. Or not. Okay, I guess you're still here. So hey, is everyone still here? Like, where is, um, like, it, I don't understand. So we killed off, what, Bob and um, Trash, right? They no longer live here because they died, right? I think. So who lives here? Like, I know they're all, like, roommates. Who is just Grim? Is the the canon now that Grim actually lives here? <laughs> All right, let's have a look. So what what are we doing? Restriction: new floor tiles allowed. Room renovation. I think just anything, to be honest. It doesn't seem to say where or what. Well, why don't we try and make this living room a little bit nicer? Let's let's do that. So I'm gonna say go back here. Let's go go here. Uh, take photos. Here we go. So we're gonna do this living space. Oh yeah, look at this. It's, I love this room. It's one of my favorites. All right, so we're gonna go in this corner. I'll go to the other corner. I'll go this way because, you know, you got the big, beautiful window. We definitely want a photo of that. Uh, and then maybe from this way behind, I guess. And maybe... All right, let's try that and see what... Let's see what happens here. All righty. So I think first things first, I'm going to take all the stains off the walls. <laughs> we'll get rid of these poles as well. Oh, poles. I'm seeing pipes. Tragic clown painting. Probably can get rid of that. We'll keep the Jerry. That is a classic. Uh, that's actually a pretty good machine. All right, this rug is going to go... Let's see. So I would like to... It says no new floor tiles, but that that doesn't mean you can't change existing floor tiles. So should we lighten it up to, to the lighter floorboards or should we keep it dark? I mean, the dark floorboards are nice. Maybe we just need new ones. Yeah. I might just... I'll just do the kitchen section as well. You know, just... I'll, I'll just do it throughout just so you have that going for you. There you go. Uh, so you like violin and cooking. Well, we could update the kitchen if you like, but we're not, it's not really part of the room. So what I might actually do, I'm going to get rid of the guitar. Don't worry, Grim, I got you covered. We'll get a violin for you instead. There you go. He's going to love it. <laughs> He's going to love it. All right, couches. Let's get this out. Let's go. Yes, absolutely. Paranormal stuff couch. Ooh, and then we go a nice blue one. That looks good to me. Get rid of that chair. Put in, could do the yellow, the classic, the contrast, or we do the same. Um, okay, okay. Violin. Not very nice colors on that violin, I'm gonna be honest, but that's okay. Get a nice rug, and then I think maybe a nice coffee table. What about a nice big coffee table? Is that, well, it makes the room feel a bit smaller, doesn't it? I think we need a small coffee table, or like this, where it's like sort of in between big and small. Hmm. The TV being here is kind of, kind of awkward. I'm wondering, maybe we should, should we move the TV to this wall? What if I get rid of this? Got the guitar over here. Why do we have so many, oh, that's right. People always left guitars, didn't they? That's why we ended up with so many. Like, what if we move the TV section over to here? Get rid of that. Get rid of two smaller little tables on that. There you go. Look at this. I think we'll move the Jerry. It does seem a bit weird, though, these different height <laughs> shelf things there. I guess I could, I could make it taller. Oh, wait, no, not, not those ones. I could use, put these in. Oh, it doesn't fit on that side. I feel like it should fit on this side. There you go. Look at all this storage. There's just a window behind it for reasons. I don't think I can remove the window, though, can I? Oh, I can. Ah, okay. Well, that solves that problem. <laughs> okay, well... I might just do that then, to be honest. Can I not? No, no, don't snap to that because it's not putting it. And if I put it here, then snap it. Yeah, like that. There we go. Just get this full on TV unit here. I like the bricks. Maybe we should continue the bricks behind that. Like I would like some light behind here. So maybe we do. Well, if I use red, this like red light to scale it down. Yeah, RGB lighting from behind the TV. There you go. That's what we want. Actually, where's that chest table? I might actually put that back because I think I can fit really nicely behind this couch now. I don't know what to do with this violin. It's kind of, it's kind of just in the room, but whatever. Yeah, no, I think that works. Then we have the couch here, little armchair there, TV now in that section. So then you still get these big windows, you know, unobstructed without the TV right in front of the windows, which I think is probably a better idea having it there anyway. Isn't that what I did over here? Oh no, this one's like sort of in the corner on a pole. <laughs> that's kind of cool. Yeah, no, I, li I like that. Now this over here, I'll just change. Oh, that's not actually on this. Oh, I guess it can't actually go on that. So I guess that makes sense. Well, anyway, I'll change that because that's not what I wanted anyway. 
This could be good. Does that fit on here? How? What is it? This? Okay, this is actually so strange that this doesn't fit on anything. Anyway, this has plates in it, so that doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Oh, yeah! This is still my, this is, I, I don't know, this piece, this whole shelf thing is like so my favorite thing ever. It's like so good. This one and the hanging one, masterpieces. Should we go lighter shelves or should we keep it dark so it sort of goes to the floor? Or should we go even darker? Actually, that one's pretty good. Okay, walls. I think maybe just even just changing it to the clean version is probably a good idea. Like, I don't think we need to do anything crazy in here. Maybe just like scrub the walls clean. How about that? <laughs> okay, we do have a random gym uh, thing here, but I guess they like it. So maybe we'll we can keep it. Maybe just show it sort of more in this corner. Oh, I guess the desk was kind of good there, wasn't it? Can we get two desks in here? Like, what if I did something like this? I was just thinking, because this is like a share house with a whole bunch of people in it, so it might be good to have more than like one spot for a computer. What if we use the three, not that one, this three-seater here, probably makes more sense, from this two, no, on this wall, probably makes a lot more sense. Let's maybe not make it come out into the room. So they sit side by side like this. Do we want to go white or do we go dark to go with the room like with the floor i mean that works pretty well and then we keep this computer get rid of that get rid of this we could use these chairs even i think that computer's gonna have to move over probably because we can have one here i think is in line with that and then you could add another computer there if you wanted and then i guess this thing is still just gonna have to go here isn't it i mean look i'm not gonna get rid of it they like it they want to work out you know to each their own now these walls here definitely could use something on it. What about some James Turner bars? That's what these are officially called. Like these? No. What about just like this? Something like productive. You know, like maybe this here, like the little whiteboard thing. I really hate how those stairs come through this wall as well. I'm not really sure what to do about <gasps> James Turner bars. That's what we can do about it. <laughs> no, they don't really fit. Uh, and then this wall is also kind of seem. I only have 15 simoleons left, uh, mind you, on this budget. So I don't actually know what to do there. I definitely think this layout is better though. Maybe not everything, but you know, in general, I quite like it. I'm wondering if these chairs should be different. Well, I don't have money to change it anyway. Um, well, I might just leave that because, unless I put this over here, it's just, I thought, because it's sort of behind the computer, it's a little harder to get to, but maybe we'll just do that. That's all right. Um, I guess, how much is this? 172. I don't think I can sell those. I'm sorry. I can clean up your kitchen though. Look, I'll just get rid of some of these things. There you go. Like I can patch up your walls. Can I afford to do this? I can do that wall. I can do a little bit of that wall and a little bit of that wall. Look, I patched up your walls. At least some of them for you. <laughs> we have one simoleon left. That's pretty good. Now, because, oh, that's right. Because now that I've remembered, I can put my paintings in here. So let's go to this one. Beautiful. Let's add a frame onto that. Uh, frame it. There you go. And maybe we can do another one because I've got a no or do we want to just do the one? Maybe just the one. I don't want to I don't want to give them too much here. Look, I'll scale it up for you guys so you can really experience it. That's pretty good. Let's um view competent work just to make sure that that's what we're after. But yeah, there we go. OK, let's uh, take the after photos. All righty. Now let's hit save and just hope that the reveal event works. It might not because of the weird locked doors in this place, but look, we'll see what happens. Ah, oh, oh, that's right. That's who lives here. Not not this robot, but the other robot. The, the <laughs> I forgot about that. All right, interior decorator called clients a lot. All right, matched up all the photos. Oh, cool. She can't do it because we're stuck inside. Yeah, okay. All right, well, let me just teleport here. Yeah, that's a problem. I don't think I can... What if I reset? That doesn't really change anything, does it? So I can get to here. Okay, so she can get to here. Trenton! <gasps> oh, we should all meet. We're meeting at Bath the Real. Oh, Trenton. I would love to. I I can't. I'm at work. Okay. So this door. Can I like unlock? I feel like you should be able to. What if I just reset it? Yeah. Reset object. Go here. Does that work? I don't think so. All right. That's kind of a problem because I think that might mean that the reveal won't work properly. But look, we'll try. I might have to go around to all my lots and just un unlock doors. Uh, yes. Whoa. Okay. Here we go. Miss D Miss Dame Noir Volts. Welcome. Reveal. All righty. Where's Grim? Oh, dang it. Come on. Well, to be fair, I kind of expected this one not to work because of the locked doors. But we did earn the money, which is good. All right, well, I am going to go home. And now we're going to react. Oh, whoa. Dang. Uh, oh, that is nice. Now, oh, whoa. Yeah. Oh, no. Ooh, that's good. Oh. Oh, yeah. No, I think this, I think this turned out a lot better. Okay, I think I reacted Perfectly. Let's go. All right, so we're back home. I still don't think I actually have enough money for the bills. I still don't. All right, I'm just going to sell these two paintings because quite frankly, I need to pay my bills. So let's do that. <laughs> okay, we're going to do one more gig today uh, after this. Hopefully we have a 25 grander 
or like a 14 even, because I'm just going to take all that cash and run with it. There's a 14 thousand dollar one here do we have oh we do have a twenty-five thousand. add a level to holy alto's place heck yeah all right so we're gonna do a level addition for twenty-five thousand tomorrow i think yeah okay so that'll solve that then we can buy this house next door in the meantime i need to go visit a museum and complete 10 excellent paintings so i'm gonna go do that now there is a museum here. Oh yeah, this is the ugly museum, isn't it? <laughs> this is like the worst museum. Let's go check it out. <laughs> it's like the world's emptiest museum. Viewer, Maya, th okay, it has to be paintings though. Okay, there is some, okay. Okay, go. Oh, I can swipe from here. Yeah, oh, I totally forgot to swipe from the other one. I want the dino head. I want this. I'm gonna take this. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but I'm gonna, okay. I need you to stop doing that real quick because I need you to take this. <laughs> What am I going to do with that? Oh, let's contemplate this. Oh, wait, I've already... Uh-oh. Candle and James Turner are both here. That's right. There was nothing in this museum to begin with anyway. Okay, stop. Why is everyone trying to talk to me? I'm going to have you this painting, please. I need to reduce my bills. Look how big this place... Why is this... Why did they make this so big? <laughs> it's so ridiculous. Also, why have they got... <laughs> okay, I didn't realize it was this bad. Like, I knew... Um... Kayla or Lil Simsy had done like a, a big video about, you know, this this lot and this is like one of the ones she hates the most. But like, why are these lights floating in the middle of the room? There's no ceiling there. They're all just like floating here when you put the roof up. Like these ones are okay because you can see they're actually hanging off this like wall in the middle. Also, there's a wall here, but the roof just kind of goes straight over and ignores it. <laughs> it's like the worst thing. Oh dear. It's like they had to fight. Oh, okay, see ya. Um, oh, hey man. Okay, why, yeah, why is everyone and their dog coming to talk to me now? Leave me alone, I'm just trying to, I'm at a museum. Like, a museum of all places is not where you have conversations with people. I'm here to, like, admire some art. What the heck? Why are there so many people? Leave me alone. Did I really, not, is that, oh, maybe that's not a painting. Maybe that doesn't count. I think that's actually a wall decoration. So I think technically that doesn't count. Oh, that's annoying. Actually, is there, oh no, there's some paintings. Oh no, those aren't paintings either. Are these paintings? These are big checks. Let's go view them. See, I don't think these are technically paintings. Uh, well, there's this one. I don't think I've seen this one. Let's go do that one. There we go. Yeah, cool. So that one actually was. The other ones weren't. Now, is there a bathroom here? There is. Okay, everyone's hanging out of the bathrooms. What the heck is going on? All right, well, I'm going to go use this toilet. Well, everybody else is gathered around this bathroom for some reason. They're, everyone's like, where did the dino head go? Did anyone see it? <laughs> did anyone know where that went? All righty. So, <laughs> we got this is worth two grand. What am I going to do with this? <laughs> There's nowhere to put it right now. Like, I need to buy the house next door just to store this thing. I'll put it in my garden. We'll put it out here. There you go. I don't know how she got it here. Also, thankfully, no one can see just over the fence because it's sitting right there. Now, I believe... Oh, yeah, there's a gold version of that. Look at that. That's fun. I'm going to put these... So, these paintings as well. I'm going to put these here. Like, so she's just leaning them up outside. So, I think... Did I actually lock, unlock these? I guess I did. <laughs> Stolen from Plum Bob Pictures Museum. That's so good. <laughs> All right, what else do I have to do here? Uh, 10 excellent paintings. All right, well, let's just go paint then. Let's go to a confident painting. Oh, I don't have that much money though. Okay, that's one. And now let's just do, I get just small because they're 50 bucks each and they're a lot quicker to do. Oh, that one's not excellent, that's normal. The heck? I guess maybe she's not in a great mood right now. Okay, let's go take a shower. Oh, let's, oh yeah, let's go take a shower. Okay, let's have, what should we have for dinner? Let's have um, faux meat Wellington. Sounds good to me. Actually, I want to be honest, it doesn't sound that good to me, but, you know, we'll have it anyway. Oh no, you're scared of the fireplace again. It's okay, I got this. I'm coming, Hagrid. Don't worry, Mama will save you. Mama's coming. <laughs> it's okay, there you go. All right, let's resume. Okie dokie. So now I'm energized. Can I do an energized painting? Is that a thing? I don't think so. <laughs> All right, let's do a small abstract painting again. Maybe I should do abstract. Maybe it should be, um something else because maybe she's not as skilled as that i think that's the thing because as you level up you get better at certain painting types don't you so she's probably actually not that skilled at this yeah see that's only normal still i think i'm shooting myself in the foot with that let's do classic small i gotta do 10 excellent paintings and i'm not even i haven't even i've done one uh hey you can now create high skill pop art okay so i could do pop art and hopefully that would be excellent quality okay that's excellent that's great so if i do pop art small this should also be well, not necessarily excellent, but it should be... It should have a better chance of getting excellent, I think. Normal? What the heck? All right, let's go back to classic. I should, <laughs> why did I mix... Why did I think mixing it up was a good idea? Yeah, there we go. Excellent. Yeah, excellent. Here we go. And I could do one more before I run out of money. I mean, I guess I could sell these, but again, not really the goal of this Let's Play, but I don't know. 
I just kind of want to get the <laughs> the frugal trait. But that's not in our rules. How's this? That is excellent. Fantastic. So let's say um, that's not what I wanted to do. I was going to click on you and say clean out your inventory. Because again, you've got so much junk in here. There you go. Uh, we also we do have 38 photos. Oh my god, they sell for 981. I'm going to get rid of them, but I kind of... How much money do I have? Oh, no, I had 24. I'm going to get rid of the money. I just don't want 38 photos sitting in my inventory. These I, we'll just dump in people's houses. Um, that's That was always the idea there. We were only selling them because that was part of something I had to do. Why don't we try... We could write... In, what does the interior decorator article do? I actually don't know. Maybe it just increases my performance. Oh, I acquired the writing skill. Good. I'm not actually sure. Is that just going to up my performance or something if I release this? Or maybe I get more like recommendations or something. Writing is magnificent. Likes writing. Sure, why not? The response to Hazel's article is great. Your top comment reads, You don't understand. I'm obsessed with these design ideas. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I don't really know what that did for us, but let's go take a quick nap. It's 5 a.m., but you know, we'll get our energy up super quick anyway, so it should be fine. Oh my gosh, are you okay? What the heck? Hagrid! No! Wellness tree. It's okay, Hagrid. Mama's coming. Mama, okay, Mama's gone. Ooh, you're so slobbery and green drooly. Okay, Mama's back with a healthy treat. Here you go. There you go. That should be better. I'm like, what is this? Did you puke? Uh, okay. Well, before I go to work, let's give you a brush. And maybe a bath wouldn't go astray. All right, let's give you a nice wash. There you go. Good as new. Oh, okay. And that can clean up the puddle for me. Okay, or not. Okay, just ignored it. Wait, does that have the puddle? It might not actually have the puddle upgrade. Oh, it has like no upgrades. Oh, okay, fair enough. <laughs> I guess that's why it's not doing anything. Uh, likes fitness, Azaya, no. Why is it asking me that? All right, let's go to work. So this is a $25,000 gig. And the good news is, hopefully we should be able to do a level renovation. Oh, what is, oh, there's lights up here. That's kind of cool. We should be able to do a level renovation, hopefully not with, with not too much trouble. Inspect Oasis Springs Mailbox. What does that do? I'm gonna inspect it. I actually don't know what that does. Does it do anything? Oh my gosh, you're so old now. Oh my gosh, Carol Alto? She's grown up, but I will, uh... Oh, no, no, not a flirty introduction. Sorry, that was a mistake. That's that's weird. Friendly introduction. Uh, all right, so talk about previous projects. What, do you, do you want your room not to be a child's room anymore? <laughs> you still have the kids' room. Are you happy? Are you cool with that? Hey, guys. All right, let's see. All right, let's uh, I'll see your mood board and I'll uh, see you discuss this. So we got, okay, we've got a few things here. Like Suburban Contempo, doesn't like Queen Anne, doesn't like DJ mixing. Very specific thing, mind you. But you do like singing, which I think we knew from before. Now, let's see, discuss, no, let's see your inspirations. Oh, okay, actually, we're good. All right, you guys can leave. All right, bye. <laughs> I still don't have a TV because I stole it last time. All right, send client away. Yeah. Okay, so this is a level edition, which means really... The photos kind of need to be just outside, right? Of the house before. So I guess I'll just do this. Actually, I don't even know if the level is going to be up. Are we restricted to where it's supposed to be? Actually, I don't know if I'm, I was taking bad photos of this house. Oh, come on. This is so slow. I get that this camera is meant for inside, but it's like taking forever to move around this lot. <laughs> All right, that'll, that'll do. Is that enough photos? You only need three, don't you? Yeah. All right, let's go to build mode. So what am I actually doing here? Top floor. Okay, yeah, that's fair enough. So down here, they also have this like bunker with like spy stuff, which is kind of cool. But anyway, we're not doing that. So over here, we're going to go up. Now, I, is this the top floor? Let's just see. Is this where I'm building? Uh, no. Wait, what is the top floor then? Restricted to top floor. Is this top floor? Okay, no. What? Is it up here? Is this where I can build? Um, What level can I build on? I don't understand. Hello? Add a level to this home. BB.enable free build. I think that should just let me build up here anyway, right? Yeah, there you go. Cool. The thing is now, I don't believe it uses the budget, so we kind of unli have unlimited budget. But I mean, look, we only had 2000 anyway, which for a level addition, I don't think is enough money. Like, I don't think we could actually afford to build a level for that. What I'm thinking, though, I'm going to build here like this. And I kind of like, I like the um, little half wall situation we've got going on here. So I kind of wanted to keep that, that vibe. Okay, I like this. I like this. And then, so I'm just going to paint all this. Now, there's obviously not a room at this point. It's kind of like multiple different things going on up here, but don't worry, we'll make this work. So, paint all that. Now here, we're going to go up and build a ceiling. We're going to remove this half wall that's randomly in the middle. Remove this half wall as well. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Build a ceiling. Okay, then I'm just going to put this on top. And then we're going to do a similar thing up here, which I guess would have originally been restricted. Like I would probably would not be allowed to build this, what I'm doing right now, but I'm going to do it anyway. I feel like we should be able to do this. So yeah, if you ever get um, restricted by the game, even though you should be able to do it, you can just do bb.enable free build and then should be fine. I'll do that same wall trim up there. Yeah, there you go. So look, now it like matches the house. It looks like a natural sort of extension up top. 
I'm not quite sure what's going on back here. I kind of want to adjust that just so it goes there. Like so, that looks good. That looks good. Now inside here, I'll move the aircon up top. So you still have the aircon unit. And they did actually have these lights, which I like the idea of because that means at night time, I guess this the little aircon sort of unit was lit up. Yeah, that's fun. <laughs> that's fun. Okay, so let's go back to daytime. Now windows, I'm gonna do a similar thing to be honest. I'm not really sure what we're gonna be doing <laughs> in all of this, but they just said a level addition with orange and singing. So I don't know. All right, there's no windows on this side of the house. So I might actually leave that having no windows on it just so it's sort of is the same. And we're gonna use these as well for the, the little window shades. So we've got the same sort of vibe kicking on throughout the house. Now these go like that. Will that look weird? No, that's okay. I'm back here. A couple windows there. And I think that'll probably do us for windows. All right, so that's that. Now, um, I might go back into live mode here and then go manage well, save. No, actually, you know what? No, I won't do that yet. I'll do stairs first. I was gonna say, because then we'll get our budget back. Uh, but stairs is certainly gonna be an interesting challenge because I don't even, I guess in the hallway, the hallway is too wide. So we could, I've got bb.free build on. So technically I shouldn't be able to do this. But the thing is, you can't even do level additions unless you can move stuff around, you know? So it's kind of silly. Um, I think I'll just get rid of these because these are going to be in the way. Now, if we move this bedroom door here, I'm just flip it the other way. It means I should be able to have some stairs here. That should work. I don't know why I left a gap there. There's not really any reason, so I'll just slide it back. All right, so that'll get there. Now, would it be nice to have some lights in here? Yes, it probably would be. So I might just, at least I can see what color I'm choosing here. <laughs> so I might just put some lights so I can see. I guess we'll just do like a white railing kind of thing. Sure, why not? Okay, let me get rid of these now. Okay, so that goes up here. So now I think if I go save a managed world and now I've loaded back into it and if I go to build mode again, we should, yeah, we've got the budget back. So now that I've, I've got the level addition with all the stuff that I wanted that was gonna not let me build it, I should be able to build up here now though, right? Oh no, so it's okay. Is, is this now the top? What is the top level? Like when it says top level, is it saying the fourth floor of the house that we don't have access to because we can't build up there? All right, well, I have, a, I've got the budget back, but at the same time, I still have to save. enable rebuild. So we'll just have to ignore the budget because I literally cannot build. I like this being like an upstairs sort of living room area and then maybe have a bedroom like here or something. This is a, a weird space. So maybe this should just be a, a bathroom. And then this section here can be like a built-in wardrobe for that bedroom. So we have a sort of a, a, a kind of long bathroom. And then this is just a hallway. And then we either have one big bedroom or we could have two bedrooms like that. How big is, well, there's actually, there's a pretty big master bedroom downstairs. So maybe I'll leave that as the master bedroom. And then up here, we could have three additional bedrooms like here. I mean, that one's pretty big too. So I think that's pretty good. So downstairs we've got, what kind of walls have we got? It's really hard to see. The basic darks selection. Okay. Well, let me get some lights in here. So I'm gonna, the budget was, well, look, the budget's 2000. So we've by far gone over that budget already. And clearly I'm ignoring part of it, but I'm gonna at least make this, you know, a usable sort of space. So what we're gonna do, I guess I'll use this uh, wall so it sort of carries up. And then I'll just, for now, paint these room, these bedrooms in this color and then we'll, we'll change it. So we're gonna have a, why don't we go for a sort of navy kind of room. We'll have a kind of a green room. No, actually it's not that green, it's more like turquoisey green room and a, well, like a pinky mauvey. Actually, not really mauvey, but I mean, like a pink, you know, you know, fun color, so there you go. All right, the bath, what do we have for the bathroom downstairs? I'm just gonna do a similar thing to that. Yeah, that works. All right, so downstairs, we're just using floorboards for all the rooms. So I think I'll just do the same sort of thing. And even in the hallway, that works for me. Bathroom is using this. I guess we could do the same sort of thing that they've got going on down here where they've got the separate toilet. So you have like the sort of washroom here and then the, the toilet in a separate room. Cause that would also make this long, bathroom feel a little less long. So maybe we do a little toilet room here, you know? Okie dokie, so let's have a look here. So we're gonna go uh, a door. Well, I'm gonna have the toilet actually come from the outside here. And then the bathroom will just be a separate door there. Then, oh, we're gonna have so many doors here though. It's like door heaven, door city. Okay, you know what? I guess we're gonna have the, I would put a door here, but I think that looks a little silly. So I'm gonna put the other one here. Okay, so there's like a billion doors up here, <laughs> but that's just what it is, okay? And then we're gonna use a half wall for our railing because I think that'll suit this build a little bit better. We could have a door out here as well, but I think because it sort of goes in front of where the windows are after that bedroom, I might not use that balcony space. Okay, I'm actually, I'm quite liking this. I think this is a great little addition. Again, like I said, I'm not, we're not gonna go like super detailed and fully furnish all this. So I'm gonna do, I'll get the same sort of stuff we have down here. So this is gonna be a little uh, toilet and toilet paper. 
And then we'll get this sink as well, like we have down there. And then I guess for the shower, I'll do something different. Maybe we just go, you know what? I'm gonna move this door. I'm gonna put the door a little bit further along about that. Yeah, that works. Okay, so we'll have little sinks here. And you know what? I'm gonna do a double sink as well, like we have downstairs. So it's all, you know, it's all similar, carrying the same sort of theme. All right, so there's that. Okay, so bedrooms, I'm just gonna do some basic beds in there. So like even just like these sort of really cheapo beds. Maybe like Holly wants to rent out her spare rooms or something. I don't know. Look, I don't know what she's doing. I'm just doing what she said. <laughs> I'm just matching the beds to the rooms. I'm just doing what Holly asked me to do. And that's a level addition. Okay. Wait, what does she actually want? I should, <laughs> I should... wait, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Before I get, yeah, before I do more. So we actually do want orange. Maybe we should do an orange uh, room then. Or an orange bed. Orange will go good with blue. So let's do that. How much is this? Nine hundred. Okay. Again, I don't want to get carried away. Like we're not going to get super expensive stuff here. I think it's probably best to get the cheapest option. Oh yeah. Here you go. Look at this. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> okay. Then what, what else is this? suburban contempo? Actually, is that a bed? Oh, there is. That's 2000. That's like the entire budget they had. Okay. Why don't we get some sofas over here then? Cause like I said, I wanted this to be like a little living space. So I think ideally you'd have like a TV or something there or maybe the other way around. Actually the other way around probably makes more sense. So like this. And then I guess it's less to go here, doesn't it? Probably just need a smaller couch, but you know, what? if they invite me back, we'll, we'll do a proper renovation. Like we'll, cause then we'll be able to access this. Hopefully if it's like a room renovation or a level of renovation. So let's say a couple of orange suburban contemporary couches that will make them happy. Singing, I'm not going to bother with that. Our beds, do this in one of the rooms. Kind of goes with the green, kind of. And pink, apparently somehow fits into this filter that we have. Orange and suburban contempo, sure. Okay, so that's, I think that's it. I think that's honestly all we're going to do here. We've got the bathroom. Uh, oh, actually, you know what? I will do uh, storage, miscellaneous. Uh, get rid of this filter real quick. So I will do in this wall one of these because that's what I do want to put there. So I'll just do that. Okay, I think that's pretty good. Like I think that is a really nice level renovation. We use like infinite budget, I guess, technically. So I don't even <laughs> know if they're going to like this, but you know, whatever. Let's take some after photos. Look, if the game didn't bug out and it worked properly, then I wouldn't have to do this. But you know, it is what it is, okay? So I'm going to say one from here and I kind of just did all the angles. So I think I just did three photos, didn't I? Okay, let's see. Let's see if this works. Call clients a lot. Here we go. This is actually pretty cool. I actually, I'm going to, like, even though I know we didn't use a budget and we had to technically cheat to make it work, I actually really like this rent. Like, I like, I really like this addition. I think it's awesome. All right, let's go reveal renovations. No, no, don't look up, guys. Don't look up yet. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Okay, the renovation. Oh, shit, she said something different. Sometimes she says renovation. All right, cover your eyes. C cover your... Cover your eyes, guys, guys. Oh, it didn't work. Why does this never... Oh, recount kids room renovation. Remember that, guys? Oh, Chaz Riggs! Can I join the garden gnomes? Hello! Yes, you may. <laughs> okay. All right, well, let me go here. Look, check this out. Yeah, I'm waiting for it to come back down. Okay, now we're gonna go back up again. And then check this out. And then also check this out. There you go. Hey, guys, what do you reckon? We got a whole level up here. Is this what you wanted, right? <laughs> Hazel alone, the Carol is unemployed. Oh, poor Carol. All right, now we wait for the final ver verdict. Now, while we're waiting for that, I'm going to react. Okay, that's pretty good. Whoa, look how much bigger the house got. Okay, so that's before from this angle. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, okay. So this is what it looks like. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's so much bigger and that's so much better. Yeah. Okay, there you go. All right, so that's our little reaction. Now we wait. Okay, you're ready. Let's see what you reckon. That's the final verdict. Yeah, you're both ready. Okie dokie, you are happy. She's very happy. I mean, it's pretty epic. They're like, how did you do this for $2,000? Oh no, is the flower bunny dead? <laughs> hey, Hazel. What is this picture? <laughs> hey, Hazel. Think I can join the renegades? No, I don't want a dead flower bunny in my club. Oh my gosh. They gave me 30 grand. Okay, well, that's great. Thanks, guys. I'm out of here. <laughs> So it was a $25,000 uh, $25, gig and they gave me a bonus of five grand. I guess because they didn't spend anything. Like they, well, they did. They spent 30 grand. But other than that, they didn't. So that's pretty epic. Wait, what did that say? Well, it went nicely, I suppose. <laughs> the client seemed to really like the new layout. Yeah, no kidding. I think I did a pretty good job. Right, so now we got 30 grand, which this time I'm going to keep it because what we're going to do, the plan was always to buy the neighbor's houses. We can put the walls up. There we go. It was to buy the neighbor's houses. And essentially when we say buy, we're going to turn this into an actual building because right now, as just a quick reminder, it is just an object. So we will essentially replace this with a build and we will deduct, I think 20,000. 
at least for it. Because that's probably what it will... I don't know. Maybe we'll just build it and see what happens. But that'll have to wait till next time. So when we come back next episode, I think we'll just build this and with the money we have. And we'll see what we end up with. So because we're per technically... This is obviously worth nothing. So we can just delete it. But we're purchasing it. So we'll turn it into a real house. We'll see how much that costs. And if it ends up not costing that much, we'll deduct you know, up to 20,000 or something for that purchase. And then I think the plan is potentially renting it out and getting roommates and living in there. Uh, I do still want to get that frugal bills uh, trait so we can spend less on our taxes. And especially once this is built up, our taxes will go up even higher. Uh, so we'll see how we go. But until then, thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time. Make sure to leave your comments, suggestions and feedback down below and have an awesome day.